Are your regulatory systems functioning? On behalf of the Squid Research Lab, I certainly hope so, because the findings we're about to present may be startling. Oh, <coughs> yeah, that's right. Uh, you may be wondering about the Squid Research Lab. Well, we research squids in a lab and other things too, like that strange video. Perhaps what you saw seemed a bit unusual, but research indicates that freelance power egg collection is becoming quite popular among inklings in a new mode called Salmon Run. Luckily, one of our fearless researchers went on location and captured this curious activity live on camera. Now, we share our findings with the world. For the first time on film, we can see this remote location, separated from Inkopolis, on the other side of the ocean. This derelict man-made island is a hotspot for freelance power egg collectors. Amazing! Inklings super jumping to the island! We concluded that four Inklings make a team, just like in Turf War. And what are they wearing? The implications! It looks like some kind of special gear provided just for this task. Huh. And it appears they're given weaponry, too. It's a power egg collector's job to defeat creatures of the salmonid genus who habitually attack for some unknown reason. And it's not just one wave, which is a plus when you're collecting power eggs. As you can see, they can be acquired from debilitated salmonid. It may sound easy, but in... What's this? Some sort of salmonid... To tell the truth, it's unlike anything we've ever seen. Just wait till I tell my boss. Ooh, that's it. It's a special kind of boss salmonid that inklings are paid a bounty to hunt. I'm afraid our brave squid friends are no match for this beast. At least, not with their current strategy. Oh, one of the inklings is down. And another. Yet somehow, the incapacitated inkling has deployed a lifesaver to call for help. Oh, I see. When a fallen freelancer gets inked by an ally, that inkling can be resuscitated. Freelancing does have its benefits. Communication is key because inklings that work together win together. Unless they don't. What an honor it is to witness this incredible struggle. How odd. These eggs have a rare appearance, even among power eggs. Could they be golden eggs? And now it looks like the inklings are transporting these golden eggs to a containment unit in the center of the site. Aha! Could it be that this is the freelancer's ultimate objective? To harvest these golden eggs and haul them to Inkopolis? Indeed, after many trials and tribulations, the inklings have collected their golden egg prize and fulfilled their corporate agenda. What we witnessed here is the harsh reality of one suspicious part-time job. Why would such a dismal occupation be so popular among Inklings? Well, it might be due to the rewards. I've heard they're quite, um, fresh, is it? More research may be required. What a day for science! If we compile any new information, you will be the first to know. We're planning to release a research report on the ongoing battle with Octarians, so stay tuned and stay fresh. <laughs> that reminds me, we have one last report for you. It's a scientific fact that new Splatoon 2 series Amiibo will be released. There are three new figures. Inkling Girl, Inkling Boy, and Inkling Squid. When you tap these amiibo, the figure character will appear in-game and befriend you. Befriend an amiibo character and they'll remember your favorite outfits, weapons, gear, and option settings. Tap your amiibo on the customization menu screen and you can swap your outfit with the amiibo figure's outfit. I'd imagine it comes in handy when waging turf wars at a friend's house. To conduct your own research, try snapping a photo with your Amiibo friend. That way you can both wear your favorite outfits. Then you can share your photos with human friends on social media via the Nintendo Switch album. Sometimes your Amiibo friend may give you special gear as a gift.
The game is compatible with previously released Splatoon Amiibo figures as well. Well, fellow researchers, today's presentation is over. We look forward to sharing more research in the future. Thanks for... Oh, forgive my apparent short-term memory loss. I have one last fact for you. Splatoon 2 launches July 21st. And the new Amiibo release that same day. That's all for today's report. Squid Research Lab, signing off.